Do you wear your seatbelt every time you're in a vehicle? Do you think about what could happen if you don't? Today I want to encourage you to wear your seatbelt, not just sometimes you're in a vehicle, but every time you're in one. My uncle was in a car accident before I was born. And he was put into a coma because he wasn't wearing a seatbelt and was ejected from the car. Although I wasn't around, it's affected my life greatly. The best way to protect yourself in a motor vehicle is by wearing your seatbelt. I'm going to express to you why you should walk alone. Each year, about 33,000 people are killed in motor vehicle crashes, according to AAA Exchange. Car crashes are the leading cause of death for people between the ages of 11 and 27 in the U.S. Seatbelts are the single most effective way of reducing the risk of death in a crash. With 45 to 60% effectiveness, they have saved, they've saved nearly 300,000 lives in the U.S. alone since 1997. The main functions of, this, of the seatbelt are to cause the occupant to decelerate at the same rate as the vehicle, to spread the force of impact over stronger parts of the body, such as your pelvis and your chest, to prevent the occupant from colliding with other parts of the car, to reduce the risk of being thrown from the vehicle, and to work together with the airbags. The seatbelt slows you down enough that when you impact with the airbag, you can impact safely. Some people think that no harm can be done, when they don't want their seatbelt because it's a short trip. But no matter the distance, it's still important. An accident can happen at any time, and it often, often happens closest to home and when, it's, when you're least expecting it. According to Teen Driver Source, in 2015, 6% of teen passengers admitted that they rarely or never wear a seatbelt. This is a 20% decline since 1997. 2,206 young adults not wearing seatbelt were killed in 2013. This is 52% of the total that died in motor crashes that year. Seatbelts are the best defense against impaired, aggressive, and distracted drivers. There are many ways to protect yourself in a motor vehicle. It's important not only as a driver, but as rear and front seat passengers as well to wear a seatbelt all the time. Research has been found that when you use your seatbelt properly, seatbelts can reduce your risk of fatal injury in a crash by 45%. When you're in a truck, it can reduce your fatal risk of fatal injury by 60%. Primary seatbelt laws are very effective in increasing the amount of seatbelt usage. States with primary laws regarding seatbelts have increased the usage by 10%. Currently, 34 of the 50 states have these primary laws. And out of those primary laws, because they have those primary laws, 90%, they have, these states have 90% usage compared to only 79% of other states that don't have primary seatbelt laws. What could happen if you don't wear your seatbelt? In a crash, according to the Center for Road Safety, a person not restrained will continue to travel forward at the same speed of the car until something stops them. If you think about it, it makes sense due to the law of physics. Something in motion stays in motion until an opposing force stops it. The only things that will stop you if you're in the front seat of a car are the windshield, the steering wheel, or the dashboard. And even with the airbag, it could cause severe damage without a seatbelt. The same thing applies to rear seat passengers, except the only thing that would stop you is the front seat. Because of the momentum of the car, the upper body of the back seat passenger often goes up over the top of the seat and could cause a collision with the front seat passenger. So don't think that just because you're not the driver that you won't be harmed by not wearing a seatbelt. Wouldn't you rather live than die? Everyone faces the risk of getting in a crash every single time that they get into a vehicle. Accidents can sometimes be out of your control, but what is in your control is to make the responsible decision to buckle up. It takes two seconds to, take, to do a task that could potentially save your life. Don't let one lazy, forgotten mistake change your life. Always remember to wear your seatbelt.